Hey everyone, welcome to my kitchen. Tonight I want to show you one of my favorite sides that I like to make for my family, especially this time of the year, the summertime. Uh, we're going to use some fresh ingredients, starting with some summer squash. Uh, I like to use at least four to five of these, and I do prefer the smaller size squash. Reason being is because they're a little more tender and they're not as seedy as the larger size. So that's just a personal preference. You can, you know, if you grow squash in your garden, you can use whatever size you've got available or whatever is at your grocery store or local produce stand. Um, we're also gonna use a couple of zucchini and onion of your choice, about a medium size onion, you wanna chop it up. Um, there again, it's to your personal preference, what size of onion you'd like in there, but it does add a lot of flavor to this dish. Um, the other thing we're gonna use is one full stick of butter, which I know is not super healthy, but it's super good. And we're also gonna use about two teaspoons of garlic salt. There again, that's to your preference. Everybody has you know, your own taste choices. You just kinda have to play around with it and see what's best for you and your family. Um, this dish actually goes well with everything. Um, there's not really anything that it doesn't go well with. Um, it's a great summertime side, and we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna get it started and show you how we prepare it. All right, next what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and put our butter in our pan. We're gonna put this on medium heat. I have a gas stove, so I guess you can adjust that accordingly depending on what kind of stove you've got. Um, we're gonna melt this butter down a little bit and let's add in our garlic salt so it kind of melts with it. I'm gonna get this melted down just a little more. It's already starting to smell good in here. All right, I'm gonna add the onion now. And when you're doing this, you just wanna make sure you're getting everything stirred in well so it gets all the flavor from the garlic and the butter. And then what we're gonna do next is we're gonna add in our veggies, our squash and our zucchini. You might wanna alternate it, that way it's not all just squash and not all just zucchini, you want some of both in there. And this will be delicious. And once you get all the veggies in the pan, you're gonna to wanna to, um, cover it. And we're gonna cook it for about 30 to 40 minutes, depending on how much squash you have. Um, and you're gonna wanna stir it occasionally. So you don't want it to burn, obviously. But you are gonna want it to be like a nice brown at the end. And we'll show you that in just a bit. So once you get all this in here, you're gonna put your lid on. We're gonna check our squash and zucchini, see how it's doing. All right, it's starting to cook down really well. You see how it's starting to get brown in the pan. We got a few more minutes to go. Um, it's actually smelling really good in here. I wish you could smell it. But anyway, I'm gonna put the pan lid back on the pan. We're gonna let it cook down just a few more minutes and then we'll show you the end. All right, I think this may be done. Let's see, oh yeah, it's nice and golden brown. I'm gonna stir it up just a little bit more. I'm gonna turn off our heat. And we're gonna set this over to the side while I prepare the other things for our meal this evening. I really hope you enjoyed our video. Um, please leave any feedback that you may have and I hope that you and your family enjoy this. Thanks for watching.